Heisman duties is taking out the trash too. One of the most gnarliest places in the world. Look at that. So lately I've been having a lot of conversations with people um, that are doing pretty huge things. Singers, uh, musicians, uh, bloggers, or potential bloggers. I, I've always encouraged them to start doing what they love to do. And it's quite interesting to see how many people won't do it. You know, I, I listen to a lot of Gary uh, Vaynerchuk and I listen to Casey Neistat and you know these guys are are doing their thing they know what they're doing they love what they're doing and they do the work and they're not afraid of taking a risk I guess that's one thing that I've learned out of my whole journey throughout this startup of a company that my wife and I are building is learning to take a risk and even if it fails I can at least say that I've tried to do it you know, and that's what's most important to me. And if I succeed even a little bit, I know the benefits are gonna be huge. I've researched a ton on social media and right now what's driving my traffic is social media. I know that I'm using Twitter and, uh, well first Instagram and then Twitter very effectively where people are opting into my website, filling out a form and they are pretty much on the waiting list, if you want to call it, to receive the app as soon as it releases. You know, it's a lot of engagement, a lot of time spent. I mean, you can't just have a social media account and not engage with your audience. It's just, you can't do that. It's, then you'll become irrelevant. I spend at least four hours daily on social media. Like in the comment is more of a praise, a follow is more of a recognition, and a DM, a direct message, is a handshake. It's quite interesting. And throughout my tactics if you will I've gained a lot of interest I gained likes I gained followers and I gained comments which all that feeds into my whole startup journey and venture um, so it's quite effective and if you have questions on or if you want to know what I do exactly you know go ahead and email me I'll, I'll display my email at the end and you guys can send me questions and I would guide you through the process because I've seen significant growth in four to five months almost 4,000 followers, that's insane, insane. And I'm not buying followers. You see those accounts with like 16.2K followers or 200K followers or close to a million followers, you know, half a mil, but yet their engagement sucks. And how do you look at their comments and look at their likes? It doesn't make sense if you have 500,000 followers and like zero to five comments. How in the world does that work? I'm just jabbering, but at the end of the day, social media is key to any business. Any business. So apparently, I gotta lose some weight, and the wifey packed me up a pretty bomb salad. Chicken, some chips, and some avocado. Two hours later. Come on. Anytime, buddy. One eternity later. You got it. Yep. Nope. Yep. Nope. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Yeah.